I'm working out at, I just got done with a set, I'm working out at my work, um, the end of the, end of the shift. Um, I wanted to make a, I'm out of breath because I just got done with a set. Um, I want to make a real quick video. I make videos like this, or a lot of videos that kind of cover the same topic. This is a little bit different. Um, it's about overtraining. I haven't really made a video about overtraining, but for people that are worried about overtraining, I've said this in a video before, I've phrased it kind of like this. It is much harder to overtrain than you think. You know, um, I've never overtrained myself, but hearing people talk about overtraining, I can confidently tell you that I bet you're not overtraining. I just tripped on that bench. Um, common symptoms of overtraining are working out for too long, you feel sick, like you have the flu or a stomach bug, or you feel achy in a horrible way, in a different way. You feel like you need to go to bed, you wanna puke, you don't feel right, you feel sick, physically ill. Most of you are not training hard enough to even get to that point. So my advice to you, stop thinking you're gonna overtrain because let me tell you, you have a better chance of overtraining if you just go into the gym for eight hours than you do trying to overtrain. I challenge you, go into the gym, try and overtrain on biceps, triceps, shoulders. Now with legs, back, I can see that because they require a lot more energy so you're gonna be tired more easily. If you try and overtrain on a leg workout, you're probably gonna overtrain because <laughs> man, with me with leg workouts, it is you know 12 sets and I'm gassed and done. But try it with biceps, shoulders, triceps, um, chest, the smaller muscles. Um, and see if you can overtrain. I challenge you to overtrain. Um, I'll be in the gym hitting a single muscle group for an hour, uh, maybe an hour and a half, sometimes two hours. I feel fine. Um, common misconception that you're going to overtrain if you're in the gym longer than 40 minutes. Now that might depend per, per how long you've been training, how many years, how long you train. That's obviously a key indicator of overtraining or if you will. Um, but I challenge you, go into the gym, try to overtrain. Um, but I'm in the gym one body part a week, hour and a half in the gym, destroying it, and I don't overtrain, I feel fine. Um, so yeah, it is harder to overtrain than you think. Trust me.